Hey, what's up guys? This is Miles with Zoho, here to give you a quick overview of what's new in Zoho Writer. There are a lot of new additions and changes that I'm excited to share with you guys, so let's get started. So the very first thing you're going to notice is the new sleek and elegant user interface. We kind of wanted to take it back to the basics and we wanted to redesign Zoho Writer with uh, simplicity and give a distraction free space for our users for writing. So one of the first things we did was we started out with taking advantage of the extra space that are available in widescreen monitors these days. So we moved the top toolbar which contains all the buttons and features to the left and we have placed it inside this menu Navicon and this has cleared a lot of space in the vertical area so now uh, it looks really minimalistic and you can also see more of your document without scrolling down. We wanted to find this right balance between a simplicity and the usability and we did accomplish this by introducing new writing modes which you can use depending upon the phase of your writing process. For instance, if you're in the initial stage of your writing process, you can work under the Compose mode, which will adjust the user interface for distraction-free writing. So you can let your ideas flow, create your content, and whenever you need tools for formatting or inserting objects, you can access them from this menu that's floating around and going to follow your cursor wherever you go or you can simply highlight the content you want to format and the menu will appear with the formatting options. And speaking of formatting, Zoho Writer now comes with 350 plus fonts that you can choose from. These are all web fonts so you can apply them without worrying about uh, the availability of these fonts in local computers because they work off of the internet, hence will be available in all the devices that has internet access. And you also have a new document design option which provides you with a dozen of different formatting and design styles that you can apply to your document with a single click. And when you're done with the writing part and are ready to move on to the next phase, say proofreading for instance, you can switch to the review mode which will ready the document for review by providing review tools like uh, spell check, version history of the document, uh, track changes, etc. And a new addition here in the review mode is this panel where comments and changes are tracked. Having this separate panel for comments and uh, changes makes it easy for you to keep a track of all the conversations and changes happening in the document. Now you can also have full control over the notifications you get from your document. You can choose to follow specific conversations or all the changes in the documents. Basically, you can keep yourself updated regarding the activities happening in your document. And you now also have the option to even lock parts of your content uh, to prevent it from being edited by other users. Uh, and in addition to that, you can also selectively allow people to access the locked content, which comes in handy for locking content for exclusive editing. You can also like comments in a conversation which is a great way to vote or show appreciation to a comment or even a quick way to respond to one. There's also an option to redact or mask confidential parts of your document which will make them invisible to your collaborators. So even during collaboration you can still protect your confidential data from being shared or exposed to other users. And one other innovation we've done in terms of collaboration is the access receipt. Now, access receipt will keep you updated regarding the access status of your document uh, from the moment you share it. You get information about who have accessed the document, who haven't accessed the document, basically get a detailed insight about what's happening after you've shared the document. And along with that comes the ability to even turn off the live cursors that comes up uh, during real-time collaboration. And once the content creation and collaboration is done and you're ready to um, just go through your document, read it from top to bottom, you can use the reader view option which comes with a day mode and a night mode and will give you a well-focused and seamless 
reading experience. Now, once you're done with reading and your content is ready and finalized, you can move on to the distribute mode, which will provide you with the options required for finalizing and distributing your document. For instance, uh, you have a new option to mark a document as final. And what this will do is this will disable all editing on the document. So your document will be finalized and ready for distribution. And for distribution, you have options to publish your document within your organization, outside web, email your document, and even an option to post directly to WordPress. You have options to mail merge it and even send your document for digital signing. And digital signing has been integrated now with the best digital signing services on the web, DocuSign and Adobe eSign services. And of course, you also have the options to export your documents in different formats and send it for printing. We hope the new Zoho Writer will give you a better, smarter, and seamless writing experience so you can be more productive and creative. To access Zoho Writer, please visit zoho.com writer. Thank you very much for your time.